Hi, John. This is Philip calling from Switzerland. How are you? I'm great, Philip. Hope you're well. Thank you. Are you are you in the States or in England or where are you? I'm in London. Ah, yeah, good, good. So London. we're we're neighbors in a way. Yeah, well, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, yeah. in, in, in global terms, we're across the street from each other. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever been here in Switzerland? No, no, I've, oh, I've, no. I've never been. I've never, okay. it, it's so, it's so strange. It's one of those things, isn't it? Where you, you, you go all over the world. I've been to, I've been to South America. I've been to, I've been to North America a lot. Sometimes you just never quite get around to seeing the beautiful places that are, you know, within, within such easy reach of you, but I, I will get there eventually. I think the pandemics made people miss travel and make them determined to go to all their place, all those okay. places they've always wanted to. Yeah. yeah. Unless the moon is the moon is falling on Earth, I mean, it could happen. See, I've got even less. I've got even less time than I thought. Yeah. I've got even less time than I thought to get to Switzerland. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that might stop a little bit of fun. If you think COVID's um, spoilt your vacation plans, the moon crashing into the Earth is going to be uh, even more devastating than that. I think. Absolutely. <laughs> what, what by, by uh, apart from Corona, what was the biggest challenge uh, on this uh, film? I think that the biggest challenge, as far as I can make out from Roland, is we had about half the time to shoot it than he'd normally have for a movie oh. like this. Mm -hmm. We had 61 days, which is, which is very little. R Roland said he, he's, you know, he'd, he'd be comfortable with, with 100. Mm -hmm. maybe 100 days maybe even pushing it a little bit but 61 days to shoot a movie like this is nothing at all you know in covid where where you know one single case among the crew would shut the whole the the whole unit down for for days at a time we, we somehow managed to get it all shot on time 61 days in and out and for such an ambitious movie i think that that was a real achievement for roland especially but all the crew contributed to that yeah Okay, your character Casey is. Uh, we we don't want to give too much away, but your your character Casey find out something is wrong with the moon, and nobody believes him, and yeah. um, not listen to each other, not believe in each other. It's a very common phenomenon these days. Do you agree? I absolutely agree. Yeah, I I I, I completely agree, and that's. That's one of the beautiful things to play in a character like Casey, a character who is rejected so much and nobody believes him and he's banging down doors and trying to get himself listened to. Mm -hmm. And he just gets, you know, he, he gets ridiculed, he gets rejected, and he's devoted his life to trying to save the world in the way that he thinks he can contribute and get in the moment where he finally meets somebody in Brian who believes him and he values his opinion. Mm -hmm. It's one of the most, one of the most, the redemption of that and seeing that the weight of all that frustration lift from him is it's, it's the defining moment for that character in the whole movie. Would you like to go to space or to the moon if, if you could? Well, I'd, I, I would have liked to, but I remember in preparation for the scene where Brian and, and Joe and Casey take off to the moon, I, we, we spoke to an astronaut. We had an astronaut on set who was advising us. And I said, if you'd, if you'd never been to space before and you didn't know like, what it was going to feel like, how long would it be during a takeoff like this that you'd be terrified and that you'd regret going? He said, you'd feel that pretty much instantly. The noise of it, the, 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 the fact that something's going to explode and it's going to blast you off into space. That seems too dangerous for somebody like me. I'll let I'll let the experts do it, uh, but but it, it it'd just be too much for me to handle. I think. Unfortunately, my time is up. Thank you so much for talking to us. Uh, uh, I hope I see you soon for for another movie. And uh, again, con congratulations to Moonfall. Thank Bye, you very John. much. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Bye.